And with that out of the way, it's time to talk Undertale. Now, I don't think I've ever... Hi. <clears throat> hey. Hi. Hi there. Hey. Hi. Oh, man. You ever wake up really late and you just... Oh. Oh. You know what I mean? Like, you just you just wake up and you're like, oh, 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 <coughs> oh. oh, oh. So this it, it might be really good that I'm ah, oh, 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 or it might be really bad. Might might be one of those low energy streams or one of those. There's way too much energy in this man. Somebody please harvest all this energy out of him so that he can eat, like, I don't know, so uh, we, uh, we, can, we can put him in a generator and fuel the city of San Francisco for years, right? I don't think that would work. I, I, I think I'd last about 10 minutes in the big person generator. Agree, read the Hitler x Goku fanfic. Um, you mean like the Anne Frank Goku fanfiction? I mean like the Anne, you, are you talking about like the Anne Frank Goku one? Cold Rain? Is that the one you're talking about? Are you talking about the Anne Frank Goku one? Wouldn't it be wild if I already was in an animated video of the, uh, the Anne Frank Goku one? Wouldn't it be wild if I already read it and there was an animation? Inside as she sat in her room, staring at That'd be her wild, room, right? She just finished writing in her if, diary. If I like if I like read the Anne Frank Goku one for somebody already. It was better than the alternative. There was alright talking to Peter and Margaret, but they were Uh this is Goku X Anne Frank, and I, I narrated this for somebody five years ago. That's what's happening. Brendan, why? Because you should never you should always expect the unexpected. Also, this was 2015. Like, I would not do that now. Boost up that volume a little bit. I would, I would not do that now. Wait, five, seven years ago. Right? 2015? Seven years ago. Seven years ago. That's right. Sorry, I had an old man moment. Real old man moment. I am going senile. I am. I. It, it's literally been 2020 for two years for me. I forgot 2021 even happened. You have to remember, 2020 went by so fucking fast because of retail hell. And then 2021 went by fast and slow. And like, I'm still in 2020. At some point, when you get old, your brain crystallizes at a certain point, And it's locked into that year. I think 2020 is that year for me. I don't want it to be that year. 2020 was five years and five, like, five minutes. The month, right? It was five years long. How could January be six months ago? Oh, I should run a benchmark test. Run benchmark. Let's see how it performs. Damn, this Laura is smooth. 
I can't wait for her to be impaled and rebar. It's just like this. Uh, it's yeah. it's. Uh, yeah. By the way, thank you, Tech Stomper, and thank yeah. you, Inviar. Thank you for the sub. Um, ray tracing. Uh, 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 what about ray? What about ray tracing? Ooh, no, I'm not gonna turn ray tracing on. <clears throat> Pure hair at normal, though. We got hair graphics. Uh, is there a frame rate limit? <laughs> of DLSS on, so... Is there a frame rate limit somewhere? No. That would be... That would be silly. That would be silly! Don't look at my specs. You'll be jealous. Also, yeah, welcome to the Blue Mountain Dew team. Uh, I gotta get new... I gotta get new Mountain Dew icons done when I have money, so... I gotta do a lot of things when I have money. Uh, overall difficulty... What are we, I, I'm just gonna play on normal, yeah. Normal. Or easy. Normal. Normal. Normal moment. We're going into the jungle, so I it's gonna be normal. Pop. Pop, 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 pop. Oh, look at that cigarette! Oh, look at that cigarette! Oh, look at that cigarette! 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 Oh, cigarette! Cigarette! Cigarette moment! 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 Cigarette! 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 I I I I I realize that's a word I shouldn't say fast. I started realizing while I was clapping and saying, "I'm like, I should be careful about language." No matter where you come from or who you are, allow us to be the first to say, Welcome to Shadow of the Tomb Raider. You know what, chat? No matter who you are, no matter where you're from, no matter how many people you've killed, no matter how many people you've drowned in the toilet, no matter how many people you stuffed inside a locker and then lit the locker on fire, you know what, chat? Welcome. To Shadow of the Tomb Raider. I can't wait for Laura to be British online. It's only been two days, but now Laura's finally gonna be British online. Okay, like usual, the menu tricked me. This is a bit loud for the stream. Need to turn it down so I can talk over it and be funny online. Or, well, no, like I always say, attempt to be funny online. Ios Montreal. no choice now. I'm not jumping out of this plane, and now you have no choice. You have no choice, Jonah. You have no choice. Now you are jumping out of this plane, Jonah. No choice. Two days earlier... I can't wait to shoot bow, eat warm liquid, lie, and die. Rebar time. Ha <laughs> ha! Rebar time! Aw. No rebar. This sucks. Ah, rebar oh, time. No, I'm right on Trinity's tail. I don't want to attract attention. I'm on my way. I won't be long.
I'm gonna cut my fucking leg off. Am I gonna cut my leg off? What? Oh, am I gonna have alone in the dark style healing? I can't wait. I wanna have some good old fashioned alone in the dark style healing. I wanna pull out like some med spray. Let's go. All right, give me a sec. I'm gonna turn. I, I wish there was a fucking. Why is there not a frame rate limit? <laughs> no, DLSS on. Balanced. Why is there not a fucking frame rate limiter so I can limit how much uh, juice this sucks out of my computer? Shit. Am I just stuck in a hole? Is that my life now, Laura? Oh, here we go. Now I get to play the game. Now keep going, Laura. I love this. I love crevasses. Already, this game is starting off near and dear to my heart. I fucking love crevices. I go- I go to the crevice club meeting every week. I talk to all the boys. Me and the boys just talking about crevices and crevasses. Our two favorite things. Me and the lads outside talking about crevices and crevasses. Couple of our favorite things. It's okay, we're out of the crevice or crevasse. However you want to say it. We out of there. We having a good time topside now. And don't worry, Laura's got gauze. Or duct tape, I mean one of the two. Damn, Laura. You stitched that up with one? Oh, do I not have a gun or anything yet? Okay. They're protecting something. Oh, oh good. Mm. Yum. Ooh. Delicious. I talked to some people in town, and they're excited. There's a VIP coming to the Day of the Dead. Name's Dominguez. 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 I know that's just a real name, but that was really awfully funny to me. All right. Uh, yep. Legitimize your ice climbing. Two pickaxe, Laura. Dominguez, Dominguez. There's somebody named Dominguez. All right, give me a second. I'm going to restart my streaming software. Sorry. I'll be right back. Sorry. I had to fix something. I, for some reason, if I don't run, like, OBS and Administrator, it drops frames all over the place. And it's still going to drop frames, but I had to make it. I'm really picky. What am I doing? What? There we go. Got it. Watch out now, Laura. Watch out now. Keep moving. See, we're back. Don't worry. That's a big coin. You see? Birds for scale. Very important. Birds for scale. What the fuck? What is this big goofy ass crystal? What is this? Sorry, Lara. There we go. That's the big penny. Beautiful. 
Is that is that like uh but uh, uh what? Somebody's got a router here, Laura. Take a couple of sneaky pics. The audio balancing in this game is so fucking nasty. Get a load of this place. Why is the audio balancing in this game so fucking? You know what? I'm not gonna care anymore. Not gonna care. Yeah, they really didn't want us in here. I'm glad we followed your father's notes. Laura, are you hurt? I saw where the passage Are you okay? You want me to clean your wound? wound? Laura, do you want me to lick your wound clean? Have you played any of the original Laura Crofts? Nope. Constellation. Like as a kid, Constellation. maybe. Sort of Pink fish. As an adult, no. Silver crowned mountain. Cause like, I don't know, after Uncharted released, I th kind of all the Tomb Raider games are horribly mediocre. Damaged, perhaps intentionally. Why would Trinity sabotage this? They usually just destroy everything. No, I, I just I just had a I had like a moment in my head where I was like, damn. Uh-oh. The router's been unlocked. Laura. Uh-oh. You gotta get out. Oh no, they turned on the temple internet. And now the temple god is watching porn and jerking it. You had him drag me out, I'd still be in there taking pictures. Really? Would you? Are you that stupid? Don't know if you'd be doing much. Also, why does Jonah look completely different in every game? Like, okay. I have to pull this up, because Jonah literally never- Jonah looks different in every game. He doesn't look like the same guy. Okay, I'm on the wiki, right? I'm on the wiki. Here's Jonah in Tomb Raider. Here's he, him in Rise of the Tomb Raider. Here's him in uh, Shadow of the Tomb Raider. He's a different guy in every one. He has a different nose in every single one. How do they do this? Yeah. Yeah. He is completely yeah. different in every fucking game. Jonah isn't a name, it's a title. Tomb Raider isn't a name, Laura. It's a title. Yeah. Thank you, Josh, for the sub and the gift yeah. subs. Dr. Dominguez is supposed to Dominguez. Sounds good. I'll try and decipher the riddle, see if the date has anything to do with it. Right. Pink yeah. fish. Silver crown. Yeah. Mountains. Look into it. Yeah. Anyway, this cafe is supposed to have really good food. I know the chef. Yeah, I'm not very hungry. <laughs> After all of that, I'm sorry. I could eat a whale. I could eat an octorock. I'm so hungry. I could eat a rock. Will Jonah finally die in this game? Yeah, probably. Ah, oh, Day of the Dead. De, de, de los Muertes. Damn, Jonah, I know you're drinking that funny uh, beer or La Cerveza. But what if you were drinking a nice Coca-Cola? Not much. He's leading a few Trinity digs in the Instead of drinking that beer, why don't you drink a nice, refreshing, ice cold Pepsi? Everyone says he's a great guy. Big help to the town. So how's your leg? Everyone says he was a great guy, and when you confront him, he's gonna be like, I was just following orders! Directions to find and then you're gonna hear, hear like the British national anthem, and then Laura's gonna freaking blow your brains out. Be like, I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. It was an accident. It goes on. Um, 
then chase the heart of the serpent to the I'm not paying attention. I should, I should, I should pay, <coughs> I should pay attention. Oh, God. Constellation Hydra, the serpent. This star is the heart. It's set in the southwest. So southwest from the Amazon River, Brazil. This date from the room. It's been horribly dry in my bedroom for like the last month or so. So usually I need like half an hour to wake up and just sit next to the humidifier so I can go and like absorb the moisture. And I didn't have that today because I woke up late. Uh, so just I, I, I expect a lot of me. Ex expelling mucus for the first like half to half hour to hour of this stream while I just sit here and mute so you don't have to hear it exactly we need to look for the silver crowned mountain in Peru there's more um, something about uh, a key what is Trinity looking for in the hidden city doctor we found it yes show me you heard that too right are we gonna have an Assassin's Creed stealth mission? Sick. Let's try to blend in. Try to blend in. Say try to blend in to the British girl. She is not blending in. She is sticking out like a sore fucking thumb. I'll stay out of their way. I'm British. Oi, be careful. Oh, I got to be. I can't be noticed. So much for a night off. Jonah, you won't be noticed because of your shape-shifting ability. I'll be noticed because I'm stupid and online. Yeah. Let's look around. Someone must know something. What about those children? Hello, children. Do you know where Dominguez is? Bazingas. Ma'am, do you know? Do you know anything? Can you believe it? This one was caught drinking the ofrendas. Ah, oh, the offerings. <laughs> I'm sure I was just as mischievous as a child. <laughs> no need to punish him. <laughs> Tequila will take care of that on its own. Oh my god. Really? You're gonna have child drinking in your game? Tisk tisk. Haha, <laughs> our kid just drank a whole <laughs> bottle of tequila. Guess you should have eaten. What a psycho. Too excited. As usual. Hi there. I'm just going to open up this box. I hope nobody owns it. Youth is wasted on the young, my dear. <laughs> so I've heard. Not me, though. I had a proper wild youth. <laughs> Tell me all your grandma heroin stories. Let's keep looking. Not youth is wasted on the young. Not me, though. I had a wild youth. Okay. Did you have a bunch of chips when you were a kid? How's your leg, by the way? It's fine if I don't think about it. Did you have a bunch of chips? Do you have any cocaina? Please, please try some. Oh, what is it? Delicious. Oh, so now what are they, apples? I'm blending what are, what is he just, he's just, what is he doing? <clears throat> How hard would it be to have like a, a meat stew texture? What is he making? I don't even, he's not even making like, he's not making anything interesting. He's not making like I, 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 uh, uh, anything good. Are those fucking like potatoes? <clears throat> Crystal Dynamics did literally no research. What are those supposed to be? <clears throat> oh look, there's a can of frijoles over there. Manzanas. Manzanas. Apples. Oh, he's cooking apples. Chips. He's not even making like tamales or something. He's not making like ta here's here's I uh, tr fucking tamales. Like oh, there are no tamales anywhere. None. Disappointed. Yeah, let me go check out the food so I can be mad about it online. <coughs> How hard is it to Google Mexican food? Uh, yeah, uh, you know, you know what, uh, you know what Hispanic food is? 
big uh, a corn and potatoes. <laughs> corn, potatoes, melons. Somebody watched one movie with the yellow piss filter and was like, yep, this is the food we need to care about. Just throw it in there. Food is really important during Day of the Dead, you fucks. Look, for my father. Maybe I could light one for my mother. I was hoping that kid was going to talk in a British accent, too. No, this is fine. I like the tiny skeletons, though. Those are pretty good. Oh, look at that. It's Bob Papyrus from Undertale. You've certainly made an impression with the locals. I like it here. Good people. <clears throat> Listen, I had really good food at a quinceanera once. I had really, really good food at a quinceanera that I got invited to. <clears throat> I don't know why I got invited to it either. Like, I don't know why my brother and me were there. Aside from it was like really distant family. Let me tell you, the fucking, oh, nonstop in my head. I'm thinking about tamales, I'm nonstop, all day, every day. I'm thinking about that, like good fucking tamales. I'll take care of these guys. I'm white as hell, but I, I will eat tamales. <clears throat> Doesn't matter. You can make them as spicy as possible and I will eat the whole rack. You make a whole rack of those bitches and I'll eat all those bitches. <clears throat> No fucking horchata. No fucking, no fucking spicy milk. Ugh, disgusted. I hope I don't have to stealth this. <clears throat> There's nothing worse than an Assassin's Creed escort mission. Nothing fucking worse. <clears throat> Like, I don't know why games still do it, because it's the fucking worst. What if it was Day of the Dead? Oh, yeah, oh my god, oh, oh, this is just, oh, this is just, oh, this is just like the movie! Oh! It's like that new Pixar movie. What? Oh, 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 oh. Encanto. No, the other one. Oh, oh. Up. No, the other one. Oh. Yes, sir. Oh. The Lorax. No, the other one. Oh, oh, oh. I forgot the name of it. Dominguez is not just the leader. Ah, Coco. That's the name of it. It's just like Coco. Yeah, yeah, I heard you. <clears throat> Love me a watch Coco. I've seen five minutes of it. Love me a watch. Love me a watch Coco. Mm. Hi, Bobby. What are you screaming for? My fault. Yes, Bobby. I hear you. What? What? Come here. What do you want? You little psycho. <clears throat> What? Oh, that guy's a gun. What is it? What are they? They're talking way too close. They're they're way too intimate there. He was like he was like within kiss range. Me and the homies just making out online. Jonah, they might have noticed me. I'll try the back alley. Of course they're gonna notice you. You're a British lady. You stick out like a sore fucking thumb, Laura. You stick out like I would trying to do this. Because I'm six foot five. They'd be like, that guy, yeah. Can never be too safe. You're very gracious. Thank you. We should go. If Laura was really British, here's the thing. If she was really British, She'd be disrespecting the Day of the Dead. She'd be grabbing food left and right and eating it. Yeah, this is Commander Rourke. Dominguez wants confirmation Croft is here. You have the photo. 
female. Caucasian. Caucasian. You got that? Female. 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 Good. I don't want anyone getting in there. They want confirmation Croft is here. Female. 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 Oh, it's the Trash King! Get out of my office. Sorry. Close the door when you leave. Right. Okay. I love that guy. Look at that guy. He's sitting upon his throne. Mighty he is. Mighty is the one who sits there with the stick. Go. Leave. <clears throat> the readings at the site are unlike anything we've ever seen. It's the key to our next phase. If this is it, we'll be ready. Sir, we smelled white woman in the air. Hi, Bobby. Sir, we smelled white woman in the air. There is a white woman in the area, sir. <clears throat> Jonah, they've entered the dig site. It's fenced off and there's a guard at the gate. I'll find another way in. I found a good spot. I'll watch the perimeter. I don't even get my bow yet, so I can't kill and murder. I gotta do like fucking, I gotta do like fucking civilization bullshit. I gotta roll around here and pretend I'm part of civilization, huh? That's some fucking bullshit. <coughs> yeah, yeah. Sir, we found three empty bottles of Smirnoff. There is a white woman in the area. <coughs> oh, am I, am I making my bow now? Am I weaponized? I heard a bow sound. There it is. There's got to be more to these Why didn't I buy a nicer bow? Right? Why didn't why didn't Laura buy like a competition level ball? What do you want? Why? 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 I'm gonna pick you up now. Yeah, I'm grabbing you. Nothing you can do about it. You be screaming, I be grabbing. Do you be screaming some more? Are you done? You done being silly? No. Be done being silly. Say hi. Say hi. They want you to say hi. Say hi. No, are you shy now? Are you shy? Are you a shy baby? Hello, baby. Mwah. I love you. You being silly? Well, bang. <clears throat> Oh god, she's so fast. What the fuck? <laughs> What's in this hole? That guy straight up looked at me. Get it over with already. That guy just actually looked at me. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Your employment has been well, how do, okay. Please, no, I have money. I can pay you. <laughs> <laughs> what a great segment. I won't hurt you. You work for Trinity. What did they find? Well, they've been searching for a temple entrance for many years. Today they found it. I have to go warn my sister. Sister, she's on her way here now. Jonah, <clears throat> can't he just tried to kill a local archaeologist. Why does Laura's skin so perfect? Find what they're looking for. Why does Laura have no like embellishments on her skin? This is Commander Rourke. All teams. No problems. No problem, Laura over here. Achiote. Nice. Zero problem, Laura. British Laura strikes again. Laura really do be like, damn, I am the Tomb Raider. All right, let's figure out the buttons again. Scramble, dodge roll. Okay. I hope the ending boss fight of this game is the exact same as the last two games, too. I know 
this figure. Ishel, the goddess of the full moon. Oh, and this is Shakshel, the new moon. It's an inscription. Shakshel, the key lies beyond her gaze. Key. This is it. The entrance must be down there. What was the boss fight? You fought a helicopter. And then the game took all your items away from you and made you throw rocks at a guy. That was the boss fight. Oh, am I going up or down? Down. Got it. Oh, you can repel down. Nice. Oh, they leveled up their game. Imagine liking these games over the Uncharted games, really. When Nathan Drake do be like, you can put a, <coughs> you can put the Donut Drake skin on me in Uncharted 2 so I can be like, oh, not enough donuts. Not enough hamburgers, not enough donuts. There we go. Nice, Laura, don't die. Is there anything to like over Uncharted? I think the... Uh, I think that the Laura Croft games are better than Uncharted 1, but that's about all I'd say. Uncharted 1 fucking sucks. All units get ready. <clears throat> Dr. Dominguez is on like, Uncharted 2 and 3 are, and, and 4 are pretty fucking good. Uncharted 1 fucking sucks. I wouldn't even say they fixed the gameplay or the gunplay in Uncharted One in the in the Nathan Drake collection. I've got this. Cause it still sucks. Enemy playing on hard, enemies throw grenades at you until you explode. They're trying to throw pineapples at you to feed you. Dead. Laura can't swim. Dead. <laughs> All units get ready. Dr. Dominguez is on his way down. What ledge did it want me to climb on? Oh shit, dude. And big jumpy. Do I have pray? <laughs> yes, praise the Lord. I am part of the Christian Gamer Association. Yes. What the? Where the fuck does it want me to jump? What? Jump and grab ledges. What? 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 <clears throat> All units get ready. Dr. Dominguez is on his way down. I'm fucking confused about this. See, this is why I hate uncharted climbing. If you don't make it disgustingly obvious where you're supposed to go, it's just worse somehow. I think I'm supposed to get down to that ledge. I don't know what the fuck it wants me to do, though. I've got this. The statue is looking at that cave. Where the fuck am I going? What? What? <laughs> 
Oh, repel. I'm supposed to swing over there. Okay. Thank you for making that perfectly clear game. Listen, they should just hire, like, me to test games. I, sh I should be like one of those Facebook ads, right? I should finally fill one of those out. Uh, because I'm really, I'm, I'm your average gamer. I'm really stupid. I mean, so if anybody's gonna figure it out, it's gonna be me. Right? The statue is looking at that cave. We got it. This is it. John, yeah, cave time. We may lose contact. Copy that. I'll keep an eye on Trinity out here. You're telling me you got a cell phone and it's not good enough to get through a cave hole? Sheesh. Ain't got good enough service to get through the cave hole? Fuck, Laura. This cave looks like it's usually underwater. Laura, you gotta drop Verizon. That's what I keep telling you. Hey, Laura, ever, ever since they lost the... Can you hear me now guy? They've sucked. Sprint has that guy now. I mean, don't get Sprint. I mean, don't get AT&T either. You know what, Laura? Just don't have a cell phone. You know what's nice? Having this from the start. I love having tech that they've previously established that I have in the other games. It's good shit. I love learning languages, too. Fuck do I love learning, rat. Got it. First rat kill of the stream! Shit, Oh no, too many rats. Are they stuck? They're stuck. They're too stupid to figure out how to walk through me. What is this place? Can't believe it took until Marvel Avengers for people to figure out that Crystal Dynamics kind of sucks as a dev. Holding cells. Then again, these games are just competently mediocre, and if Marvel's Avengers didn't have like a looting system, it would have also probably been like competently mediocre. So, I mean, hey. I love digging in holes. You know me, dig a hole, have a goal. Hmm. 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 Oh, secret. Oh, wow. You know what? I didn't have to do a whole thing. Props to uh, Crystal Dynamics. I didn't have to go into my inventory to check out what I got. You know what? Props, yeah. Did I get an ancient coin? Gotta find my first base camp. Uh, requires the reinforced knife. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, do I have to swim? Okay. Now I can swim. I wasn't allowed to earlier because it was too open an area. And they were afraid of giving me player freedom. And that'd be scary. Oh, eel! Epic eel jump scare, guys. Subnautica did it better, though. Am I gonna have to fight an eel? Eel! This is stupid. That bitch hungry. Why are you giving me eel jump scares?
Oh, good. More claustrophobic moments. Oh, good. Rock moment. Go, Laura, go. What if she just stayed here? Laura, you're gonna die. Keep going, Laura. This is horrid. Laura out the hole. Oh, a lot of crevasses. Can't wait to get back to the crevice club and talk about all the cool crevices I've seen. Jimbo from the Crevice Club is gonna love this fucking game. He's gonna be so excited. Crevussy. Oh. I have to find the temple Dominguez is looking. Oh, good. I need the reinforced knife. More, more bullshit. Oh, good. Sorry, Laura. You'll have to get that gear before you want to be able to progress. Oop. She was dead. Don't even give me that. She died. Right there, I just got impaled. I died right there. Jonah, I made it. I'm in an underground temple. I'm in an underground ziggurat. Oh, no. Oh, that's not good. Laura, Trinity's blasting their way in. I can tell it's causing tremors. There's a pyramid. I'm gonna get to the top. Why are they blasting their way in? Because, like, I don't know, they could just find somebody and hire somebody who likes spelunking, who's not Laura. Why can't they find an evil spelunker to, like, do evil Laura stuff? Yeah, honestly, you know what these games need is an evil Laura. Good. There are platforms <clears throat> that can help me reach the top. Like, unironically. Looking for something Bobby. to weigh them down. You're breaking up. Got some activity here. These games need an evil Laura. They just do. Like somebody named Tiffany, who's an American adventurer, who's worse than Laura. I need I need somebody to root against. Right? I need I need somebody who I, I can fucking root against. Bubby, oh my god, I'm gonna lock you out if you don't stop. Bubby, I'm gonna lock you out if you don't stop. Do you wanna be locked out? Do you wanna be upstairs? Is that where you want it, Bubby? Is that where you want to be? I have to raise that bell somehow. Away from all this delicious plastic? See, this game just needs a villain you can actually hate. They, they're literally, here, here's what you would should have done. Evil Laura. It's that simple, too. Like, not even... Not even evil Laura specifically, just another adventurer who is as good as Laura, who is evil. Make her an American, make her like eating, uh, talking about Starbuck. Now maybe, in fact, I might make the Tomb Raider games worse personally. Um, but like, what if there was a, what if there was somebody named Tiffany? Or, or, her name is Lara, what if, what if her name was Laura? You know how Lara's Lara Croft versus Laura House. Am I gonna play the new Pokemon game? I mean, yeah, I'm gonna spend sixty dollars of my hard-earned money, and I'm gonna play the new Pokemon game. Yeah, it is. It is incredibly likely that I'm gonna spend sixty dollars of my hard-earned money, and later tonight be online with Pokemon Arceus when it releases. If it has an eleven o'clock release, I will probably be here at around eleven to eleven thirty because that's the way that the world works. Gotta be online with the new Pokemon Legends Arceus, so I can get Gengar. You really gonna spend sixty dollars for a PS2 game? Shut the fuck up, redditor. Are you really gonna go online on Reddit? Fucking uh, uh, shut shut up, redditor. Knife. Knife this rope, Laura. Epic. Opa Laura style. Pfft. 
Go on to our video games to learn your video game things and facts. What is that? Huh. Death, wh death whistle? Death whistle, huh? What is this doing? Oh, it's a cart track. Well, that works. Where's the cart at? Need to find a way to destroy that debris. There, is there supposed to be a cart here? Uh... Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay, I got it. All right, we gotta turn it this way. Uh, I'm probably gonna pick Cyndaquil. Having a Gen 2 Pokemon making me happy. Having a Gen 2 boy making me happy. Um, Cause I am a simple man. I see Gen 2, I go, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, but I think I'll enjoy it. Oh, I gotta turn it all, I gotta, honestly, I gotta turn it all the way around. I think I'll probably enjoy Arceus. I mean, I enjoyed enough of Sword and Shield, and at least it made the streams fun. There we go. Pull this bitch up. But I mean, yeah, I watched somebody playing Arceus for a little while. Um, I think I'll enjoy it. Will I make fun of it still? Yeah. Will I enjoy it? Probably, yeah. Bing bong. Laura and her destructive puzzle solving. Once again, saves the day. Great job, Laura. Great job, Laura. Instead of calling in a team and saving all these artifacts and fighting Trinity, you, uh, you just gotta destroy what you gotta destroy, right? You gotta do what you gotta do, right? That's why I don't mind. Oh, bye bye. My hand had an itch, and I, gra I went to grab a drink, and then it gave me a fucking prompt. I hate. Oh, why'd I do that again? Bye, Laura. I'm just worried the game's gonna get repetitive after catching Pokemon for every single quest. I mean, I don't expect, like, a leveling system or anything. I don't expect, like, a full RPG. I, I, I expect a Pokemon game with a little bit more openness. Meaning, like, I go here, I get the Pokemon. I go here, I fight the Pokemon. That's a Pokemon game, right? It's a little more different and a little more, like, uh, mechanically sound. Everything I've seen about it, it is just a little bit different, but it's a Pokemon game. And props to them, props to Game Freak for one thing, there's not two versions of this fucking game. Jonah. Yeah, I'm here. Jonah, there's a mural here. There's only one version of the fucking game. Shows a box. I'm so fucking surprised that they only are putting out one so version of the fucking show. game. That must be what's in the hidden city. I am so surprised there's not Pokemon Legends Ar Arceus, Pokemon Legends Deoxys. Like, holy shit! The two version stuff needs to end. Looks like a series of cataclysms. Now, fr coming from me, I don't really care about the two version thing because I always buy a copy for my wife anyway. But for people who really want Pokemon from both versions, Bullshit. Kugul Khan is the god of creation and destruction. Oh my god, the graphics conversation. All right. The graphics conversation about Pokemon Arceus. Who fucking cares? What do you expect out of a game on the Switch? All right, not even that. Talking about graphics is such a 2011 thing to do. It looks fine. Who gives a shit?
It looks like a Pokemon game on the Switch. It looks fucking fine. That's the one point of contention that I have. Visual style is bland and it looks like a Unity asset flip. What game did you pl what game did you see? What game did you like see? Look at SMT. Yeah, it's Pokemon. Like who gives a shit? That's my that's my thing is like it's Pokemon. Why give a shit? If you give a shit about it, you weren't going to play it anyway. It looks like a Pokemon game. And you fainted. Right? Derail the stream with Pokemon moments. In for a backstroke. It looks like a Pokemon game. That is That is what it looks like. When encountering aggressive it looks like a Pokemon weird open-world Pokemon game. And I mean, it's on the Switch, so the open-world doesn't time. render as much out further. If you take Pokemon, like, this looks perfectly you fine for a Switch game. You will encounter a number of... Do I think there are going to be long stretches of nothing? Yeah. Do I think I'm going to have a problem with the game? Yeah. Team includes various core. Next excursion, finish your survey. With the headquarters of the Galaxy. Do I wish it was higher resolution? Yeah, I wish it was on PC. Just put it on PC. Include discovering a specific Pokemon. I don't think it looks that bad. I think it looks like a Switch game. Versus SMT, which is a completely different game. And a completely different style of game. Technically, it will be on PC. Oh, you're right. Um, I mean, SMT... Literally is a dungeon game, right? So you don't have a giant, dynamic, open world that you have to develop, right? You just have dungeons. Is it is it open world or is it open spaces? Continue... There are no fundamental minds. Oh, that's a review. I just want uh, gameplay. Uh, is there an overworld in SMT5? Know that you are no, there's singular areas. Aren't there? There are dungeon areas, just like every other video game. Yeah, of course SMT looks a lot better, because they're instanced. Show me, like, the open- there we go. I'm assuming that it's instanced areas. Like, this is Gorgas, yeah. But also, like, <laughs> SMT is- uh, for fucking nerds, I'm sorry. It's instanced areas versus like a, a big, f a fat open world. And I don't know, like I don't, I don't treat it like a. If it's not as good as this, it's not good. Like, it's just fine. They look fine. It looks like a fine Switch game. SMT is a dork game. Jonah, I found a dagger. Right? I'm still gonna have problems with probably a lack of Pokemon that I love. Um, but this is like the most they've decided to innovate in literally years. So I mean, I'm I'm excited to get a chance to play something different with Pokemon. I don't know, I just don't think, like, the graphics are bad is, like, the worst thing you can say about the game. I think it's perfectly within, like, acceptable parameters. What I'm not excited about is 
Dumbasses ain't gonna put every nine all 900 Pokemon in. This sucks. Jonah, get to higher ground. But yeah, I mean, I have zero interest in SMT. Um, just because of the way the monster collection works and, like, I don't know. The billions of stats and the fucking UI. Everything looks like a mess. SMT gives me a migraine looking at it. I, pr I think I played Devil Summoner on the 3DS. And it's just like, man, I don't want to care that much about it. I don't want to meld monsters. And like the, If you're going to have me meld monsters, at that point, just give me Digimon, because at least if it gets complicated, I know Digimon. SMT just gets so fucking complicated. It's like, I ain't got time for that. Okay. At some point, I'll pick it up if I can get it for, you know, less than 60 bucks. But I mean, that's why I play Pokemon. It's simple. You know why I like Pokemon? Because it's simple. I don't, I'm not looking for a challenge in JRPGs, is the thing. I don't look for a challenge. Because there, it takes so much fucking time and I get bored. Every JRPG that has been like, quote unquote, a challenge, I have dropped. The only JRPGs I can competently finish are Pokemon, because my brain doesn't care. What do you think is in there? I don't know, but I hear the readings are off the charts. Let's just make sure Death. Good thing they don't know. Fuck. Ah, don't worry, I'll fix it. This is taking way too long. Dominguez has to wait for us when he gets Watch here. this. It's not gonna be pretty. This is a full-on stealth segment. They want me to play it exactly the right way. See? Just stealthy enough. But I mean, yeah, S SMT definitively is definitely a nerd game. Definitely for fucking dorks. Um, which, like, hey, fair. I, I just play Pokemon because no brain, and then I can uh, get the lizard, and then the lizard does a big move, and I, and I go, yeah. I get, I get to animal, and the animal go, oh, I'm gonna bite you, and then it's like, oh, I bit him! SMT is like, open your soul to the darkness and release the depths within! SMT is for, like, if you're, if you're Chuny. It's, it's if you're a Chuny, bio. You're fucking Otaku. Unseal the left hand of darkness. And summon the devil. SMT looks like Persona, but worse. Yeah, it, it, S, SMT is essentially like bad Persona. I would say that. Everything I've played of SMT, everything I've seen of SMT, it's kind of like shit Persona for nerds. Like somebody who would wear a bandage around their hand and say they're about to unseal the darkness within. Like David loves Persona, or sorry, SMT and Persona, right? So like, since I know David, that's my expectation of an SMT fan. Nerds. Oh, I have guns now. Cool. Time to kill Laura. Sorry, Laura. Sorry. I hope that's all of them. Time to kill Laura. Take the 50 bucks out of these guys' pockets. That's some great AI right there. But yeah, I mean, SMT, I don't know. At some point, I'm going to get the one on Switch and give it a try. Um, because I might end up liking it, because I can be edgy as hell sometimes. I, I can, you know, I can log on to Club Penguin without my parents' permission, right? I can be a little edgy. I can go to Disney.com. I can watch YouTubes without, I can watch YouTube videos that my mom says I'm not allowed to watch, you know? I, 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 I stay up an hour every night before my bedtime's up, right? I can be a little edgy. Um, but like, I don't know. I, I think Arceus, like, I, I... 
I want to defend Arceus because I always love it when people like dig on a Pokemon game. I'm sure I'm going to have problems with it, and I'm sure exploration is going to be a big part of that. I just don't think the graphics are a problem. Stop. Right? Don't hurt her. I don't think graphics are going to be the issue with Arceus, especially when I see it moving in action. Um, I think it's, I think it's, it's like a non-issue for me. Um, but then again, I enjoyed Sword and Shield, so I have low expectations for any Pokemon game out the gate. I just think I just think a big part of me is gonna like it and a big part of me is gonna hate it. But it's more interesting than Sword and Shield, so happy to eat, happy to beef. Oh, look at this! Oh, 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 yummy! Oh, like part of me doesn't want to be like a Pokemon shill, a Nintendo shill. The other part of me is like. Mistake, graphics right? bad it's like it's, it's not like eh, eh, eh. right I can recognize that I don't know it's something I grew up with a kid with a kid I grew up with a kid I didn't grow up with a kid I, it's something I grew up with as a kid right so it's something that I'm always wanting to go back to and enjoy again, like I did when I was a kid. And part of growing up is leaving some things behind, um, but also part of being a man-child on the internet is never letting anything go, ever. So, I mean, hey, I don't want to let anything go, ever. I want to be a nostalgia grappler. You're lying. Lara, you felt it when you took the key. Tremors are common. But Tsunami is coming. This is the first of many catastrophes you're doing. You would have done the same. Oh, God. Yeah. By taking the key, you set the apocalypse in motion. Do you realize the tragedy you have unleashed? The cleansing has begun. Falls to me now to stop it before it consumes us all. Oh, I get it. Laura's the bad guy. Ha ha. Oh my god, the tsunami's literally right there. This is so stupid. This is stupid. What do you mean the tsunami's right there? That's dumb as hell. This is fucking dumb. Rebar. Sorry, Laura, you did this. You killed all these people. Hey, Laura, you did this. You killed all these innocents. And now you should be able to dual wield two pistols. Look at all this warder. They really wanted to show off this warder that they did. Somebody was really proud of one water segment, so they were like, wait, well, I'll start of the game. Right here. Love warder. Bye bye, Laura. Am I supposed to do it at a specific time? There we go. My grandma got me my first Pokemon game. Same, Pokemon Black. <laughs> fake fan, fake fan, fake fan. Oh, you like Pokemon, huh? What was your first Pokemon game? Oh, Black. <laughs> Gen 1ers, when they hear somebody likes Pokemon Black. To be fair, that's me too. I fucking hate Pokemon Black so much. I hate it. I can't like it. I'm gonna retry it at some point. If your Pokemon game, if your first one wasn't red and blue, uh, 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 you're wrong. Pokemon Black sucks. And I have no problem saying that it sucks, even if I'm wrong. I don't care. 
That might be my number one bad opinion for people. It sucks. Basic Pokemon plot, something something Pokemon superiority, something something like, oh, we wrote a plot into the Pokemon game for the first time. I just like Heart Gold and Soul Silver so much. I like Gold and Silver a lot too. Cause it's just, it's simple. You gotta get stronger. And it has content up until level 80 that doesn't rely on multiplayer or, 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 or like trading or battling real people. You know what I love about Heart Gold and Soul Silver and why it's like my favorite and best Pokemon game is because it's, it's, it's a Pokemon game. Beginning to end, it's a Pokemon game, and you fight Red, and you feel like you've had so much. You've had a wonderful adventure. And it's like, I don't care what Humphrey Dumphrey is doing with the big Mega Mince machine. I don't care. Right? I don't care what big boy Humphrey, Humphrey Dumphrey Green Hair is doing. I don't care about what my fake friends are doing. Right? Pokemon Black is like the most JRPG Pokemon game that I've played, I think. And I just hated it. Because, I don't know. Like, something about the idea of you feeling like yourself and just getting stronger. And, uh, uh, like, making the Pokemon, like, the game feel more personal because of the lack of character made it such a stronger game for me. Am I saving a child? Epic, dude. Laura, are you, are you gonna kill that kid? Laura, you killed that kid. They just had child death in a Tomb Raider game, and they don't want to impale Laura with rebar? Shit. Me too. Oh, there we go, talking about rebar! Oh, thank goodness they brought the impaling back. <laughs> Speak of the devil and you. <laughs> Speak of the devil and the devil will appear. Uh, I know, I know, I'm, I know I have bad opinions when it comes to black and white. See, here's the thing. Um, as somebody with a bunch of bad opinions, I do understand that like, yeah, I know black and white's really good. Yeah, I need to give it another chance. And at some point I will. I'll buy it and then I'll fucking emulate it. Same with Black and White 2. I've heard Black and White 2 are better. Why is there no Pokemon Gray? Oh, I gotta go up. That's why. Laura, it hits different when it's a kid, huh? Those of you who don't know, like, there's people up there. They weren't trying to rescue the kids. What the fuck? Um, so for those of you who don't know, I, I, I dungeon master for a podcast uh, called Please Stop Talking in our in our D&D Perilous Storytelling. I was reading comments on the last episode, and a couple people are mad at me for saying that no child killing, right? After everything that my father went through, I gave Trinity exactly what they wanted. He'll use the box and the knife to remake the world. To remake it into what? I don't know. He, he thinks he can rid it of sin and... People are mad at me in the comments of the D&D podcast because I have a strict no child killing rule. Okay? I, I promise. No, 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 no. We have to get... I have like two rules when I DM, right? No sex stuff. No child killing. Those are like my two rules, right? I have to go. I'm the only one. You're the only one that can what? You don't Damn, Jonah's mad. All this, Laura. Not everything is about you. Yeah, it is. The game is literally called Laura Croft Tomb Raider: Shadow of the Tomb Raider. Now. Besides, what do we got to go on? A riddle? We're gonna need Why are you playing D and D then? Silver crowns to get to the hidden city. No sex stuff puts in horny knife. Listen, I'm just not. I'm. I'm. I, I've had one awkward encounter. Where somebody wanted me to describe a sexual encounter for them. And then we'll find us a place. So like there can be some silly horny stuff, just no sex stuff. I'm just not just I'm not I'm not gonna describe sex scenes. 
it doesn't happen unless it's really funny. If it's really funny, then yeah, maybe. No, I just, I draw the line at killing kids in like D&D. That's, 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 I, no. There are a couple lines that I draw and I, I draw the line there. What qualifies it as being funny? Like if two people are having sex and the party like, so let's say the party is like doing a chase, right? And they bust through a window and there's two people like fucking and they're both wearing clown masks and you can hear a <laughs> as they're pounding away and they go, Whoa! and then like, I don't know, seltzer water comes out instead of cum, right? That's funny. See, I could, I could make sex funny in a D because sex is like a normal thing, I think we're looking for right? A but it's just, I'm my, it's not really a no the sex rule. It's more a no describing sexual encounters rule. No party member having sex with another character rule. Because if a party member wants to fucking have sex with a barmaid, then yeah, sure, have sex with the barmaid, fine. The Wake up, says, your dick burns. The the you have, the you have like, you have like rock syphilis, wow. right? I wonder what the twins are. This storm looks like bad news. It's just a little rain. Everybody is finally caught up to like the fact that Laura's a bitch in this game, haven't they? If we find it, how do we know we have the right one? Gut feeling? It's our only clue. Imagine having sex with an elemental and then getting rock syphilis. <laughs> the says there'll be more disasters. The best way we can help them is to put a stop to it and Trinity. Okay. But how do we really know? Jonah, what I felt when I took the dagger. You mean the tremors of the tsunami? More than that. I felt like I woke something up. I know that it's not practical. I know that it's hard to believe, but you need to trust me. We have to trust each other. Now you reminded me of that fanfic of a guy I fucking a flame atronach from Skyrim. To be fair, the flame atronachs in Skyrim are pretty hot. I don't like this storm. Should we come back in the morning? We're so close. I guess a little turbulence wouldn't stop turning the either. Miguel, is there anywhere to land? Yeah, I can put you down near Kuhak Deku. Let's go. Contact! It might get bumpy! Damn, that's really bumpy. That's a little too bumpy. Death hail. If you pour soap into a water elemental, does it stay a water elemental or does it become a clean elemental? Huh. I never thought about that. What if Laura raided a tomb and she opened up a big door and even inside the door there was a giant, like, cavern and just in the cavern there was a, a building like a modern 1980s building and what if it had a neon sign and what if it said freddy fazbear's pizzeria wouldn't that be fucked up milk elemental i'm writing that down i'm writing i'm writing down milk elemental i'm writing it down i'm keeping that i'm saving that i'm storing that Whole party of lactose intolerant adventures. Guess what they meet? Guess what they run into? Milk Elemental. My cows are acting pretty weird. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
milk ele milk elemental at living in the udders. Milk elemental live in the udders. <laughs> oh my guns. I'm cold and sad. And I lost all my weapons as per usual. I'm cold and sad amid the jungle. There's a monkey, monk monkey. Welcome to the jungle. We've got monkeys. Ah, wood. Laura, craft your own bowl. Could be useful. Brendan, check Discord really quick. Why? Oh, for the thing. Okay. No, 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 no. I'll keep this for later. I'll save this for later. All this wood. This wood is mine. This is all my wood. Hello? What are these focus Anyone? mixtures? Oh, do I get max pain pills now? Look at all them birds. Where are they? I have to find them. What am I going to do with all this wood? I'm going to make my own bowl. I'm going to make my own wooden planks. I'm going to I'm going to make I'm going to make I'm going to make um I'm going to make a little wooden shack. Someone's over there. I have to get to them. Uh-oh, Laura, be careful. Damn, this game do be gorgeous. I love it when Laura... Egg. Oh, I didn't take the eggs. Laura, take... Laura. Laura, grease those eggs. Laura, you're a psycho. You're fucked up. Grease those eggs. Laura, look at all the monkey. Here. Just hanging out, having a good time. How the monkeys? <laughs> oh, they do be great. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, that's not survivors, the monkeys. I thought that monkey was wearing pants. Hello? Laura, the, the monkeys. They're not gonna be that close if there's a guy there. All I'm saying, Laura, they're not gonna be close. There's just there's guys there. What the fuck is this shit? Laura, what Laura, 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 Laura. What the Laura? I hope no one else was hurt. No other village destroyed. I need to stop these taking that before it's too late. Sure. I don't have any more. I have no more skill points. What do you mean, you psychos? Ooh, thingy. Oh, a flight, a flight log from. Stop being so fast. Hot and dry for the next three days. Dario de Vuelo, nice. Oh, dude, I don't even have pickaxes. I can't even legitimately climb. Dude, this sucks. I don't even have pickaxes. A handkerchief. This is so fast and smooth. Look at this fast and smooth handkerchief. Look at this bitch. Look at this bitch spin! And then I flip the bitch. There we go. And then I roll the bitch. And then I flip the bitch. And then I roll the bitch. And then I flip the bitch. And then I roll the bitch. And then I flip the bitch. Was that all my stuff? Damn, the monkey's trying to get it. I gotta get my bowl. Handkerchief. Why? Just punch it. 
I won't be able to open that without a tool. Uh, you are a tool, Laura. Baz bazing bazinga. <laughs> climb up that? No. Do I climb up here? It's not a handkerchief, friend. It's a cum rag. Laura does that a lot. <laughs> Let me go be cum. I get it. 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 Tetanus time. Smart, Laura. Great job. There we go. Get to metal. Eels, Laura! They're back! And they're hungrier than ever. Get it, Laura. Not- why is it knife-shaped? Fuck off. Fuck you! Fuck you! You made it literally shaped like a knife! Fuck you! God, that's so fucking stupid. Holy shit. Dude, I make that sound too. Is that a frog? <laughs> Collect salvage to sharpen your knife. Show me the knife again real quick. It's a piece of scrap and it's literally shaped like a knife. It has a handle. It's fucking stupid. That's dumb. That's dumb. I can use this. Still oh, I can use this. I can use a salvage to sharpen a knife. I can. Need a bit more. Maybe there's some in this mysterious hole. Can't go into this mysterious hole yet. <clears throat> there we go. There's some scrap. Got everything I need. Should head back to camp. And now, upgrade your knife. Alright, what outfits we got? Show me the outfits. What are we, tactical? Robes of Puka Huck? Explorer? Adventurer? Survivor? Commando? Remnant Jacket? Desert Tank? Infiltrator? What else we got? Oh, yeah! That's what I'm talking about, baby! Yeah! This is <laughs> fucking awful, I love it. <laughs> yeah, baby! Knife. That should be sharp enough. <coughs> Something's still holding the supplies up. Ah, oh, there's a second rope tethering them. That's right, Laura. That's right, Laura. Polygonal Laura. We finally got polygonal Laura. Hell yeah.
Thank goodness. Thank goodness it lets me use polygonal aura. I can get my gear back. <laughs> Why didn't I pack all my equipment together? Miss Croft? Anyone? Come in! Miguel? Where are you? Damn! You know, Laura, keep that thing on her. This might be too much. I might have to change this back, because this might be too much. This might not be enough polygons. This might be too much for me. Oh, I have a billion bows. That's right. Hmm... Thinking about fashion. Let's go with this one. There we go. Let's get just enough polygons, but still a little uncomfortable, right? Just so we can trick people who join the stream and they're like, what? Why, why do you look like that? Just enough. Just enough for it to look like the real model. Now this looks like a like an indie game. Like somebody's first action adventure indie game. Perfect. <laughs> I've re <laughs> I've resexualized Laura. Pray I don't do it again. I've re bimbofied Laura. Pray I don't do it again. Miguel? Like this. Oh, Flair. Miguel? <laughs> Where are you? Oh, no. <sighs> Miguel? Miguel? Oh boy, rotten animal flesh. Is that a capybara? Is that a huge capybara? That bitch, that looks like a big fucking capybara. That bitch about to eat some oranges. That bitch about to chill. That capybara about to chill in some fucking steam. It's gone. It went home. Good. That capybara about to sit in a steam bath. Miguel? Eat an orange. Oh, capybara! Brendan, you make me violent sometimes. Listen, if you watch this stream and you don't feel violent, like 60, oh, Miguel. If you don't feel violent 60% of the time, then you're not watching the right stream. If I don't, if I don't like, if I don't make you incredibly violent every once in a while, then you're watching the, the, the wrong fucking stream. Baby. Oh, Bubby, too. Eh. Bro, same, to be honest. Holy shit. Ha, uh, I just destroy- I'll destroy na native wildlife. Oh, uh, here we go. Hey, chat, are you ready? Bang! <laughs> Only one. Got 
to be careful here. I need hide. I'm sorry. I need hide. And Laura, it's not me doing this. Laura's doing it. Listen, if Laura didn't kill monkeys, I wouldn't be able to kill the monkey. If Laura, if Laura wasn't a monkey, if Laura didn't kill, like, monkeys in the jungle, then I wouldn't be able to kill them. That's the dev's fault, not mine. Jaggers. Jaguar. That's it. Oh, shit. Hi. I like how it just waits for me. Oh, nice. Oh, I went through the hole. I like the sound they make too, like a thwomp. Urgh. Urgh. Thanks for waiting for me, bud. That's a good Jaguar design though. I like how angry they look. That's good shit. This is a good fight, not gonna lie. That is good shit. They look pissed off. I like that. Wiggle. Oh, God. Wiggle. I'm trying to wiggle. Am I dead? Okay. <laughs> there we go. Good job, Laura. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Baby two. This is Bubby looking at plastic after I've just yelled at her. She's like, you know what? Not worth getting yelled at. That was literally Bubby thinking about plastic. Oh, dude, that's a good animation. I like that. Why did he run away? That was a good ragdoll his ragdoll the wife. Ragdoll the Jaguar wife. Ragdoll the Jaguar wife away from Laura, the fucking murderer. The, that Jaguar was literally just like, you're not worth it. That Jaguar is straight up just, you're not worth it, Laura. You're not even worth the effort, Laura. Watch me kill this bird. Bazinga. I need it. I needed feathers. There we go. Listen, there are resources here. And I'll kill a bird because I need some resources. If I gotta kill a bird, I gotta kill a bird. All right. It's a tribute to my old RuneScape friend, Bird Killer 400. <laughs> Sending me messages over TeamSpeak, uh, pictures of him, just all the birds he's killed. The real moral of the story is that Laura Croft she is stinky. Frog. <laughs> Finally! Revenge.
I don't even get anything from that. I just killed the frog because I could. I don't even get anything from it. I just killed it because I could. I had to. If I didn't do it to him, he would have done it to me. Oh my god, a bunny! <laughs> Grab that. Grab this. Two bop, blue bop. That's what I always say. Couple of things I'm about in this life: inner tubin and inner lubin. B buzzing, buzzing. Oh shit! I'm fine. What? What was that? There wasn't even a splash. I just, uh, like lightly fell into the water. Oh, so dainty you are, Laura. Oh no, I don't have the pickaxes yet, so I can't legitimate, legitimately tree climb or ice climb. I'm going over here in case there's a secret little tomb. There is. Oh, I don't even have the climbing axe. Boo! We gotta get to the rest of the plane, baby! Oop. Oh, this is the part that Jonah was in. Jonah! Jonah already left. Come on, Laura. Whoop. Come on, Laura. Jonah's dead. sort of parasite. I was looking for some warm wood, but it doesn't grow around here. Let me see. <laughs> what are you doing? If we leave it in there, it'll only get worse. Sit. <sighs> Let me rip this worm out of your arm. Uh, you sure you know what you're doing? Uh, <laughs> I had something similar happen to me when I was a child in Egypt. I won't lie, it's gonna hurt. I think that storm from earlier was the storm. The one from the mural. I don't know. Uh, uh, I think maybe we should stop and take stock. We've been pushing so hard forward and <laughs> flying into that storm. I didn't think it was going to be that bad. I... Well, I should have insisted we turn back. I mean, I get it. You lock onto a problem and everything else just disappears. <laughs> I'm with you. It's my choice. Most of the time. But if we die, who stops the cataclysms? Who keeps Trinity from doing what they want? This is so much funnier with the fucking polygon skin and not talking. And if I don't, then I'll just let everyone down. This- this makes this game like a 6 out of 10 to a strong 7 out of 10. We could have turned back. This has immensely improved my immersion. Worm! <laughs> Maybe we should give him a name. Henry! Okay. Eli? No, my cousin. He's always trying to get under my skin. <laughs> Goodbye, Eli. Worm moment. <laughs> Ha! 
High res, low poly Laura. I like how the dirt renders on her face still. Like, that's really funny. We should go. Like, the, the texture for the dirt is just still there. Sounds good. It's such a relief to have Jonah back, especially after Miguel. Oh, I get different. Jonah didn't ask what happened. Ah, oh, cool. Look at these. Look at these pickaxes. Oh, gold pickaxe. Uh, yeah, uh, Laura Bougie. Yeah, Laura Bougie. Is Laura Bougie? Laura is definitely Bougie. I have to remember what the original one looks like. I, I gotta check every once in a while to see what the OG Laura looks like. Oh, but some of the out other outfits give you benefits. This one's stupid. Rotate Laura. Rotate Laura. You bring the delivery inside? I checked earlier and it wasn't there yet. Rotate Laura. Rotate Laura. All right, yeah, I'm going to take a break. I think um one of my patent pending, one of my one of my iconic breaks. Um I will be back. I'm going to play some relaxing Nintendo music for you. And I will return. I'm back. Ooh. Oh, back into Laura's happy hole. Uh, mm, Brendan, no. <laughs> Remind me, never say Laura's happy hole ever again. <laughs> Animal Crossing, happy hole designer. Mm. Mm, no. Mm. <laughs> Animal Crossing, happy hole designer. Can't wait to design some brand new holes. It wants me to go that way, but there's a tomb back here, so, like, you're gonna have to wait a little while, Jonah. I, I know where a secret is. I know where a silly secret is, Jonah, and you don't know where it is, so I'm not going that way. Whee! Alive. <laughs> he's just- he's just- Laura, where did you go? Laura, I went over here to kill a frog! I'm just murking frogs. Oh, go. Laura, Laura, Laura. Na, 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 na. All right, let's find, let's find one of those, one of those, one of those Laura holes here. There we go. All right, this is a silly challenge tomb. There we go. Nice, Laura. Get that box, too. Crank that some bitch. Great. Oh, I found a friendship tea. Nice. It's it's too fast. There's a little more. Imagine recording this and then, like, sending this to a friend of just the power of Christ compels you. I'm not going to find any hidden information. I don't care. I want to find a secret. No one's been through here in years. Thank goodness I stole my fucking rope arrow. Ooh. Lore for lore a croft. Wait. <laughs> That's not fucking obvious. Wow. Almost got me. Ha ha. This skull is deformed, flat, oh. and longer than what we consider normal. Some people believe this is evidence the Inca were contacted by extraterrestrials. <laughs> it's more likely the result of hair binding, a human practice of deformation so ancient. That's a big, long skull. It also has evidence of trepanation, a medical procedure in which a whole. That's a big, long skull, not gonna lie. 
<laughs> Marge. <laughs> oh no. Good, but what if I don't want to go out? What if I want to go in deeper? And here, I thought this would be simple. Wow, Laura, good job. You to climb up there? Great job, Laura. I can't wait for Laura to pull out a gun and just start popping. My favorite part of the game when Laura's like got like a moral decision and she decides to solve the moral decision by shooting it. And then being sad about it later. I'm posting this to my vent tumbler. Please don't follow it unless you're serious. Had to kill 15 members of Trinity today. Very sad about it. Rough day. Not going to lie. Rough day at the office, huh, Laura? I've killed 15 people today. I feel very upset about it. Laura definitely be like, Ringo is my favorite beetle. Shit. Bitch, nice try. Try to fucking get me with that shit. The sarcophagus now. Shit, I'll have to keep climbing. <laughs> Shit, that was so emotionless. Shit, I'll have to keep climbing. Oh, uh, even she's done. Even Laura is done. Shit, I gotta keep climbing. No, I just liked how emotionless that shit was delivered. Just, shit, gotta keep climbing. Guess I gotta keep going. Time to unlock these tombs. Really excited about the whole thing. Shit, I better keep going. Shit. Better keep go- shit. Better keep going, I guess. Shit. Damn, looks like all my friends are dead. Better keep on moving. I'm really upset about this whole situation. You can see that my brain is big and fat and large, but not big and fat and large enough to save my friends. Sorry, I just disassociated there for a second while I was saying that. What? Laura, you're going this way. Stop showing me that way. We're going this way. Come on. We got a new shirt. Should check out this new shirt that I won't wear. Who doesn't go to a store when you get home after buying clothes? Like, you definitely go and put on all the clothes, right? To see how you look at home, right? Like that's not just me. Like when you get clothes, when you get clothes, you go home and you try on everything just to see how it looks, right? Like in different lighting. No, no. When I took the key, you're like, I gotta check everything. How's this shirt look? How the pants look? How the shoe look? It's real. How the overshirt look? How this jacket look? How this look? How that look? Just like put them in a drawer and just ignore them, like eh. Let's just find Kwakiaku, okay? Okay. You know, if it was about... Oh, I have to craft it. Okay. <laughs> Would you, though? When oh, you there's pieces of gear. Neat. So there are full body outfits, and then there are also pieces of gear. Okay. Neat. How many skill points do I have, two? It's not revenge. I mean, honestly, just take that. 
Oh, I need an adjacent skill. Oh, okay, I can't get that yet. Let's do that. Reduce damage when falling from heights. Sure. Sure. I don't know what I'm clicking on. I'm just clicking the button until I unlock something. Is that a Facebook reward? It says it has like the Facebook logo on it. Is there a Facebook reward? Sick. Oh, I get the Facebook gold bow. I got the Twitter, the golden knife. There were, there were social media rewards for this game. Who follows Crystal Dynamics on Twitter? Oh, I do, I do, I do. I want to get all the new Laura news. I can't not get news about Laura, my favorite character in all video game media. Said no one ever. We can get through here. Give me a hand. Oh boy! It must be Kwakyaku. We have to get down there. Hey, a town. Nice. I hope I, I hope Alora doesn't like go and kill a bunch of civilians. That'd be fucked up. Come on, stay close to me. This is definitely not a path. We'll figure it out. Don't worry. You're the high poly guy. I'm the low poly girl. That sounds like a song, right? Almost there. Almost there. Oh, thank you, Roger Cheeto Official, for the one-person raid. Hell yeah. Welcome. Thank you for the raid. Thank you, Laura, for the rock. Low poly girl, high poly guy. Sounds like somebody's band or a song on, like, an Anamanaguchi album. You're all right. I I'm okay. I'm okay. New Porter Robinson song. High def guy. What? Did Jonah just, uh, like, Jonah, did, you, <laughs> did he fall? For a split second, he had, like, a wily e. Coyote moment. He just got back up. Okay. Been the Inca. They knew a lot about hydraulics. Hi, Dave. Guy. Low poly girl. You rock my world. You make me squirrel. Hi, Dave. Guy. Low poly girl. Oh, good. I can't use this monolith because I don't know anything about uh, ancient Didex. Me too. The Inca did not know anything about hydraulics. Yeah, but they had that calendar, right? They had that calendar, the, the like 2012 calendar, right? Or is that the Mayans? That was the Mayans, right? These are the Inca. What about the Pinto and the Santa Maria? This water is drinkable. <laughs> you want to try it? Uh, mm, I love potable water. The Canopa Llama! Is a oh, this thing, I fucking love this thing. Animal <laughs> this Somebody smoke weed out of this thing. Of Somebody definitely smoked weed out of this. Like, they put it in that box over there, but they definitely smoked weed out of it before they did that. It's too heavy. Give me a hand. Please help me, Jonah. I'm too weak. <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Let's let it go. Slowly. Oh, cause it water. It water. I get it. Fill with water. Fill, fill. Oh yeah. Hey, that did something. I think the water powers the bridge somehow. Need to get the water flowing to the bucket. The whole bucket and lever system here. Pulleys and levers. <laughs> Every Laura Croft tomb literally full of pulleys and levers. Good. Let's see what those counterweights need to get the water flowing to the bucket. We got the we got the water flowing in the bucket. Ugh, the bucket's leaking. Oh no. All right, let's try this again. Oh, 
What am I supposed? What the fuck am I supposed to do here? I'm going to have to let it go. Hurry! I can't hold this much longer. No, not that. What am I? What am I doing here, Laura? Water flow into the bucket. Well, yeah, I know I need to get the water flowing into the bucket, Laura, but like, what? I thought I'm supposed to like hit that to that. Need to get the water flowing to the. Bucket. Shut the fuck up, Laura! I'm gonna have. I'm about to have a wacky and crazy Laura Croft moment. No, am I supposed to grab that? Like, what am I? What am I doing here? I saw the rope bridge too, but I don't see a rope to attach it to. What? Oh, I gotta go down here. Okay. Got it, got it, got it. Oh, I didn't even see there was a lower part. Alright, cool, cool, cool. I figured it out. Whenever I'm not doing a puzzle well, it's usually because there's an area that I just wasn't paying attention to. All the information isn't present to me right there. Blame every puzzle on my lack of information. Alright, time it. There we go. Just like that. You can let go. Bring that rope bridge up! Ooh, dig. We did it! Jonah, we did it! Is he already on the other side? They didn't want to show me Jonah jumping animation. Is that it? F uh, fine, fair, 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 fine. Yeah, Jonah looks different in every game uh, because they keep just finding uh, new Jonas. Somebody, somebody earlier said Jonah isn't just a name, it's a title bestowed upon somebody. Jonah's not a name. Jonah's not an individual. It's a, 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 it's a group. Sure. It's a bunch of friends, all named Jonah, all Samoan. What is it? It's a recipe. It's a big coin. Seems to be a mixture of herbs. Could help if we run into any more jaguars. Let's hope we don't. Way out is over here. Jonah's just something in the mind. Oh! Look at that. It saturates the shit. It saturates this shit. Nice. Oh, sorry. Capybara! Jaguars. Oh, box. Whatever weapon these were attached to has rusted away in the jungle's humidity. There's something etched on them. Can barely make it out. I'm trying to make it out, Laura. It's right there. How do you want me to... There. Oh, you. sorry. Difficult... It says difficulties be damned, Laura. Laura, it says difficult... I can read that, Laura. Laura, why can't you read that? PH fa... Right there, Laura. Right there. P PH faucet, Laura. Difficulties be damned. Lieutenant Colonel P. H. Fawcett, Laura. P. H. Jesus Christ, Laura. Percy, well, there is supposed to be a secret city of gold in Peru. Paititi, every treasure hunter on Earth is looking. Got him. But Dad's notes stop in Mexico. Like he's lost interest. Oh, more about your fucking dad, Laura. Oh, the shut the fuck up about your dad, Laura. Laura, shut the. F Nobody wants to hear any more about your fucking dad, Laura. 
Oh, my dad, my dad, my dad, my dad, my dad, my dad, my dad. Oh, my dad did this, my dad did that. Find your own adventure, Laura. Stop relying on your papa. That's the right way, this is the wrong way. Okay, good. Don't worry, Jonah, I'm going in hole. <laughs> <laughs> Man, does this really have to be this long? There's this loading screen. Is that what this is? Am I being tricked right now? Ah, oh, challenge tomb. Ooh, capybara! I got oil from it, nice. Can't wait to learn all these secrets. I think most, I think most of like the challenge tomb stuff is gonna be like, here's an outfit, Laura. What I get? Cool. Show me the location of the cool stuff. Here's a here's a brand new outfit, Laura. Laura, look, you found a pair of pants. Laura, good job. You risked life and limb, and then you found a pair of pants. I like how the game's so non-confident in the repelling thing. I like how the game is so like not confident in the repelling mechanic that it has to tell you every single time. Um, this is how you repel. This is how you repel. Um, this is how you repel. Grab this. That starts shut. Grab this. Nuts and bolts. Grab this. Nuts and bolts. Grab this. Grab this. Where the fuck do you want me to go now? Was that everything? Did I just get a little satchel? Look at this fucking dude. He only has one pickaxe. He's not a legitimate ice climber. Only one pickaxe. Not good at this, are you, bud? Okay. I see. Uh, oh, up here. There we go, over here. Oh, shit! Are there bad guys around here? Oh no. I hear grunting. Ooh, that sounds bad. There's this. Nice, nice, nice. Do I have more skill points? No, I don't. Apparently I have more upgrades. New gear, new gear. Nah, I don't care. Is this Tomb Raider or Assassin's Creed? Yes. I mean, this also has like a secret society just like Assassin's Creed has. Where it's just, uh, like, you gotta fight the bad boy secret society. Because they're bad boys. Am I gonna get jump scared here? No, no jump scare? Fair. I don't know, Laura. Is someone in here? Is someone about to jump scare us? All right, what's the path here? <sighs> maybe I can just maybe I can just trick the game and get through here. I don't have any explosives or anything yet. Oh no, maybe I can can I make fire arrows? No, I can. Okay. Yeah, that's what it wants me to do.
No, not fire arrows. Okay. I don't think I can do anything here yet. Um... Yeah, because that doesn't break. Unless that's the other side. What the... The fuck do you want me to do, game? Why'd you put a challenge tomb right in front of me and then halfway through it, I can't do it? Because I don't have the right equipment. Why would you make half measures? There we go. Sometimes I also can't tell when you can jump above something, but I figured it out! Alright, nice. Epic. I'd like to say- I'd like to see you say this. No. Listen, I'm not your dancing little chimp. You can- you can throw a hard word at me and be like, Ah, right, Brennan, say this! Say this! No! I'm not gonna dance for you. No! Funnier if I don't. Don't have to. Okay, this is just a barrier. Really effective with how many rocks were right there. Okay. Makes sense. Uh, go this way then. This is how I exit the tomb. That's how I leave. What was I supposed to get here? Uh, I gotta go all the way back around. Great. All right. Cool. I gotta go all the way back around. Cool. Epic. Pog. We just run all the way back around. No, 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 no. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Put the exit there. Then where was the secret thing I needed to get? Ow. Ow. All right. Well, all the way back around, back into the tomb. I got to do all that platforming all over again. What was I supposed to fucking get? What was I supposed to grab? Oh, God. Yep. All right. Forgot about that trap. Oh, no. I'm trying. Oh, dead. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Forgot about that trap. I was just rolling around. I forgot that I jumped over it first time. Jump. Oop. I'll have to climb to make it across. There we go. All right, kind of got it figured out. I just didn't figure out where... Oop. I just didn't figure out where I was supposed to go... After there. Are they going to do that sequence again with the rock? No? There's a guy up there somewhere going... Rah, rah, rock, rock, rock. Where did I fuck up? What did I goof? What did I what did I goof? Back through here. I went through here. There's a material right there. This is just a, a cairn. Mine, Laura, mine. I got gold. Was that what it was that the what I was supposed to get? No, okay, I see. Grapple axe is still fucking broken. Good shit. Brennan, I don't mean to alarm you, but there's a femoid in your video game. Oh no, how horrible. There is a lady and a woman right here on the screen. Why? 
Why would video games do this to me? They have betrayed me. Video games have finally betrayed me for the last time. First it was Marvel by introducing Black Widow on screen, then giving her her own movie. Now it is video's game. Oh god, oh my, oh my god, oh, 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 oh fuck. I can't believe my life is over. My life is ruined and over. I can't believe it. What am I supposed to do with this? <clears throat> am I pushing this bitch? I am pushing this bitch. Okay. I can't believe they made women main characters in video games. This is why I only play Uncharted and I listen to Nathan Drake go <laughs> I don't have the rope climber yet? Bullshit. Give me that as a basic piece of equipment. Laura could have brought that. You wouldn't fucking know. You wouldn't fucking know. Laura could have brought that. You wouldn't fucking know. Oh boy, more pulleys and levers. Oh, got a whole elevator. Oh, fuck, Brendan. No, 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 no. Live. Oh, barely. Barely, barely live, Laura. Barely. Can we get back up? Nope, we're dead. <laughs> Good death animation. Oh, God. Here? Really? I see. I see where I'm supposed to go now. I see. I figured it out. I see. I see. Laura just off to the abyssal darkness, as we all are. Laura just finally enjoying the, the, the sights and sounds of the jungle before she heads off into the abyssal darkness. What kind of fucked up things you think are in the abyssal darkness? You think that's where, like, food mascots go to die after they're removed? That's where I think the Grimace is. And the Chicken Nugget Twins. That's where I think they are. I think they're out there. And I think people just don't want us to know about it. I think the government doesn't want you to know. Laura, what the... I did it again. I think the government doesn't want us to know about the Abyssal Darkness holding every food mascot. That's where the hotter Tony the Tiger is, so if, we're, if you're looking to fund an expedition... There's gotta be some rich fucking guy out there, right? Some, like, wacko rich guy... ...trying to make Tony the Tiger as hot as possible. He's just, like, paying different fur furry artists. He's trying to find the hottest Tony the Tiger variant. All right, now show me Twink Tony. Okay. Okay. Now show me Bear Tony, okay? Okay. Now show me Fitness Instructor Tony, okay? Okay. Okay. All right, now show me working at a Denny's at 3 a.m. Tony. Okay, can we move that up to 4 a.m.? Okay. Okay. Not quite there. Uh, why did I... I'm so used to the other Tomb Raider games. When you jump towards a rope, um, Laura grabs the rope. Oh, hold on, stop. Stop at Bear Tony. All right. Okay, all right. Give him cool sunglasses. No, no, wait. Give him 2002 sunglasses. All right. That's a pretty, that's a pretty high-spec Tony. I don't want the McNugget twins to be in hell. No, why, sh why are they in hell? We don't want the Chicken Nugget twins to be in hell. What about M Ronald McDonald's dog, Sunday? Ronald, Ronald McDonald's humanoid humanoid animal dog, Sunday. Where's Ronald McDonald's abomination at? Shouldn't be in hell. What about the Grimace? Where's the Grimace at? Is the Grimace in hell? The Grimace is too powerful for hells. Yeah, I agree. There we go. Held on to it. 
Make your own elevator, Laura. The, the Grimace would never be admitted to hell. He's too smooth. He, he would literally, like, um... You know when somebody... Okay, this is really... This is gonna be way too hard to explain and not worth the joke, but I'm gonna do it anyway because that's literally what I do online. You know how in a movie, when a character pickpockets somebody, or in a TV show when a character pickpockets somebody, and I don't know, maybe I have to, like, visually... Maybe I should visually demonstrate this. Let me turn camera on. It'll be easier if I visually demonstrate this, right? Like, all right, imagine this is a person, okay? This is a person. This is their, this is their front. This is their back, okay? You know a movie when, like, a character pickpockets somebody? Grimace avoiding hell, he would walk up to St. Peter, like... And, like, steal, he'd, like, you know how they, like, flip him around, like... And they, like, fucking pickpocket as they do it. It'd be just like that. It would be, like, a full, like... And St. Peter wouldn't know. And Grimace, in heaven. All right? And St. Peter would be, like, name, and Grimace would just walk among the crowd. Are you implying Grimace is a thief? Yes. I am, I am implying that Grimace is a thief, yeah. Where does Grimace hide his eggs? Not good enough. How do you think they make the fucking <laughs> Egg McMuffin? The square egg. They got the square egg patty. Grimace lays them already cooked. Ronald has done horrible, unspeakable things to the Grimace. That looks like a way. That looks like the way. That's the way, okay. The Grimace is there in the abyssal darkness waiting for you. He's hungry. He's so fucking hungry. He's so fucking hungry. But like, yeah, I, I, I don't think Grimace is in the abyssal darkness. I think he's in, he's in heaven. I, I, think he, I think he's stealthily like super pickpocketed. And I think he got into heaven by stealing the key from St. Peter. I, I think he's there. I think he's hiding from God in one of the heaven Denny's. One of the heavenly Denny's, the Hennies. And God's a goofy, silly guy. He's a silly, goofy guy. So like, he wouldn't, he wouldn't care. He'd just be like, you know what, fair. Oh, cool. Increase climbing skills to drive. That was worth it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Grimace committed too many war crimes. No, he's fine. See, what Grimace did was uh, what everybody should do. He committed a bunch of sins and then he got baptized again. He just said, I'm a little baby. What's a good Grimace voice? I'm just a little baby. I'm a baby. Just a little baby. You gotta let me into heaven. I'm just a little baby. And then God's like, you know what? Fine. You are a little baby. You know what, Grimace? You are a little baby. Question for the Christian heads in chat. If you commit a bunch of sin, but then you get amnesia, and you never remember your past where you committed a bunch of sin, and then you go and become like a good person, you like become like a like a loving teacher, um, do you still go to hell? Our atheism host right there. Our atheism post right there. If you get amnesia, do you still go to hell? But you've like, you've like burned down an orphanage and you like killed somebody with a knife. Like really fucking awful when you were a bad guy. But then you get amnesia and you're like a good guy, right? Any Christian heads in chat? Oh, you gotta say this, the magic words. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. All you got how, how do I get into heaven, Mr. Priest? <laughs> but actually, what he's saying is, I don't know, just say, I'm sorry. Please let me in. I'm sorry. Please let me in. <laughs> you know what? Uh, you committed unspeakable atrocities, but you seem really sorry. You find anything? 
another of those Maya altars. What's are we? Please let me in. An old camp. I'm such a little good boy. We should keep going. Right. Everybody likes me. I'm such a silly little good boy. You know what? You are a silly little good boy. Those atrocities you committed, not a big problem. Those people, they're in heaven. A couple of them are in hell, because they didn't say I'm sorry for, uh, I don't know, pissing on the toilet seat. Ain't nothing make me more mad than some motherfucker pissing on the toilet seat and not cleaning it up. If you sprinkle when you tinkle, be a sweetie, wipe the fucking CD! Says it right there! Jonah, help me with this. <laughs> Three, two, one. Somebody left her after I said that. Seat pisser. Whoever left, you're a seat pisser. Seat pisser. Anyway, the Jaguar's back. Anyway, the Jaguar's back and he's hungry. Seat pisser, seat pisser, seat pisser. Oh boy. That's gonna be epic. New, new, new. What if I don't? Oh, I die. Cool. Seat pisser, seat pisser, pissing on the seat pisser, p seat pisser, seat pisser, pissing on the seat pisser. New, new, new. Bang. Yeah, run away. All oh, those gibbons. Nice. Oh, silly little monkey. A funny little guy. And I'll take his skin and make clothes out of it. Oh, monkey. I'll fucking do it. I swear on my fucking life. <laughs> Got him. Gibbons would piss on the toilet seat. That's why I took care of them. I'm sorry. Yomba! Are you okay? Help me with this. Your back looks bad. That's because it's low poly, Jonah. My back looks bad because it's low poly. I'm gonna go make camp. Jonah, my back looks bad because it doesn't- I don't have enough polygons, Jonah. I notice my pee stream gets wider as I age. You think it, we're ever gonna reach, like, the cyberpunk future where you can get, like, hose attachments on your dick? Hey, horse! Um, like, and just a little, like, just a little, like, like a nozzle, so you can just twist your dick and adjust, so there's, like, a mist setting. What if you could change your piss to have, like, a mist setting? Just... You know, with everything we've been through recently... Jet setting. I've been thinking about my brother. Jack off with the mist setting on your dick. Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm not sorry, but I am. In a way, I'm sorry for putting that image in my head. Not for the putting the image in your head, because I don't give a shit. Uh, but putting the image in my head, I'm sorry for me. Brendan, why? I don't know, because I, I speak the first thing that comes to my mind usually. So I'm fucked up and crazy. Sorry, I'm normal. Sorry, I'm normal. Sorry, I'm normal. Let's talk about taxes. Anybody, everybody, anybody do their taxes? I haven't done mine yet, because I haven't gotten my papers yet. Still waiting on my tax papers. Haven't gotten them yet. Still waiting on them. <laughs> Thank you.
when I was in graphic design class, I thought it was really cool. We were supposed to make a product and use it, another product as a base. And I thought I was the funniest motherfucker online when I like found a found a package of bounty paper towels and I put Boba Fett on there. I thought I was the funniest fucking guy in the class. I was like, get it? Because you're about bounty. Oh, <laughs> I was just thinking about that. Get it, cause it's bounty. It's a bounty hunter. He's Boba Fett. Should have put IG88 on there. That's the only good robot. That's the only good bounty hunter. Hide things, but her especially. Why would he do that? After she died, he thought they'd cause me. That's the funniest joke this whole stream. Didn't stop me from looking at them, of course. No, that's not true. I'm here. Oh. Funniest joke all stream. I'm physically here. Heck one! Where are my other glasses at, by the way? Where the fuck are they? Where are all my glasses at? I can only find my green one. Where am I? I wonder where my black one is. the silver box of Isha to remake. One sec. I'm going to go find my other glasses real quick. I wonder where they are. I'll be right back. Oh, I found them. There we go. Oh. Sometimes my green ones hurt my nose. All right, adjust. Adjusted. If you had that power, what would you do? <laughs> Panic, probably. You wouldn't go back to a <laughs> bazooka. It's bazinga, you philistine. <laughs> bazooka. I lose everything else. No way. Jonah would be way more likable. Like not gonna lie. Not Laura is incredibly unlikable. But everything I love now. I think that's a core problem with these games. Is an unlikable protagonist. Like, who gives a shit, Laura? That and like they took three games. Three games where Laura's not confident in her abilities. Three games. All the other Tomb Raider games, Laura Croft was kind of like a badass, right? She was like a, I'm a fucking gonna get in here, get the shit I need to get, and get out. First game, it's fine. She's vulnerable. She doesn't know what she's doing. Should have figured that out by the second game. To claim her treasure, the adventure oh my god. Must Is this a baby moment? Can I not get so a baby? Can I just not? Can I skip the baby moment? Lara, are you having a baby moment? In a minute, Dad. Yes, Father. I'm having a baby moment out on the terrace next to a big mansion. Oh, my father built me a castle. This bitch got her own theme park. I cannot relate to this character. I cannot relate to this fucking character. This bitch got her own theme park. I can't. Lara climbs out over a lake of bubbling lava. I can't relate to this. I can't. She got an she got her own Burger King play place in her backyard. I can't fucking feel bad for her. Up there in the crow's nest. I'll have to do better. It's gone. Where'd the ball go? Is it just gone forever now? What? Wee! Wee! I cannot, I cannot feel bad for Laura at all. I can't. I just, I can't feel bad for her at all. What is this, a medicine ball? Strange beasts cross our hero's path. Hard to tell if they're bloodthirsty. I feel like this is supposed to be like a feel-good moment, right? But like, I can't relate because I'm not rich. Somebody, some fucking crypto bro loves this game though, and he's trying to pressure Squeenix into Laura Croft NFTs. I'm feeling it. I'm, I'm feeling it. Laura Croft gets a splinter, and then her 15 attendants come out to kiss her boo-boo. 
fire for cars at 100 paces. Oh, we're going to shoot cans. Oh, hole. They got out through that hole in the garden. They went, they just phased through the wall. Or I'd be freaked out if I was you. Oh, a box. Oh, white queen. Oh, you mean Laura. <laughs> oh, white queen. I can't believe they put Laura in this game twice. <laughs> it's a metaphor. Oh, the white queen. Again with the White Queen. Laura, come on. You are the White Queen. I just, I want to see if I can break her animation as in, like a child. One second. Yeah, there we go. Now, oh, oh yeah, I did it. Fuck yeah. Hell yeah, let's do it again. Slide taunted, slide taunted, slide taunted, slide taunted, slide taunted. She is, she's not the white queen, she's the white witch burner. Yeah, there we go. Let's do it again. That fucking slapping sound. <laughs> <laughs> if I do it just right, if I do it just right, we can get Laura like stuck in the tree. <laughs> Come on, I'm just trying to get Laura stuck in the tree. It'd be really funny. Please. I could, I could do it once, I could do it again. There we go, almost. I found the exact spot for it. Now I just gotta get it just right. Rest of the stream. <laughs> just me trying to get Laura in a tree. Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's fine, I'm normal now. Laura, what are you playing out there, sweetie? The I'm playing Golem, Dad. <laughs> uh, Laura, are you playing goblins outside again? <laughs> Honey, she's playing goblins again. Oh, uh, just let her play goblins. She can play goblins as much as she wants. <laughs> Amazing. Croft has entered a burial chamber that has not been disturbed in millennia. Honey, just let her play goblins, you know? She doesn't get a lot of time playing goblins outside. Her proportions are weird. They're weird in game as an adult too. Am I done playing? Okay, I'm done playing around in the playground. You know what, this playground segment did serve a purpose. Uh, I was just playing around in the playground, so I get it. Did serve a purpose. Coming dad, I'm done playing goblins. Coming father. Brendan, go back to the slide, okay. One second, curious, what happens if I involve physics objects? What if I throw physics objects into the mix?
Gotta time this just right. Okay. Whatever. I'm, I'm done. Whatever. Ooh, lore. Laura lore. Laura lore. Laura lore. Laura lore. Now for the real treasure in the forbidden tomb. We gotta get cookies. Is that what it's gonna be? Now for the real treasure. We gotta steal dad's cookies. We're, we're stealing a snack, aren't we? What does Laura have to do with any of this? She's in her room doing her homework. She hasn't much time. Climb the castle, brave adventurer. Will never expect Croft to climb the castle. She's gonna fall and break her leg, ain't she? The castle tower is taller than she thought. You're fine, Lara. You're fine. This pipe is gonna break. No, it's gonna be the wood. Oh, see, for Croft. The gutter's gonna break. Oh, okay. Our hero spies another entrance. Yeah, if my kid was doing this, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to like heartily explain why this is a horrible idea. Oh crow! Go on. The fuck out of here, crow! This is my house! We got satellite TV! And you can't watch any of it. Young Lara confronts the extraordinary height and danger and pushes it from her mind. Ooh. Oh, the B Sonnet box. Nice. Yeah, just put all your weight on the gutter. Yep, knew it was going to happen. Here comes the pipe. Nice. Oh, the cloth. Showing off those cloth physics, huh? Now you're showing off those hair physics, huh? We go back to low poly Laura, please. Can Laura be low poly again? I want low poly Laura. I wish the, the child Laura was also low poly. Wow! Wow, look at that! Look at that! Wow! She's gonna fall and like fall through the glass and then die. There, there, there are not gonna be any death states for the child Laura Croft. I'm not worried about it. This is a memory Laura's having. Obviously in her memory she did it pit fucking perfect every time. Me also, me also narrating myself when I'm afraid. Our fearless adventurer has to go to the bathroom, but it's night night time, so it's very scary out. He'll have to go through the hallway and get into the bathroom without alerting the evil beasts. Shit! Shit. Oh, Laura! More gutter falls. Epic. There's a concussion. She's close now. Potty mouth Laura. Tisk tisk. This is why unrelatability, Laura. Being a potty mouth, tisk tisk. Last, she enters the forbidden tomb. Oh, Laura Croft in the forbidden tomb. This is all the stuff my dad colonized. I mean stole. I mean got. I mean treasured. I mean got. I mean stole. I mean got. I mean colonized. I mean got. I mean treasures. Oh my dad's treasures! I mean, I mean pillages. I mean raids. I mean, I mean tomb raids. I mean, I mean treasures. I mean Find cool that stuff. The great bat stole the queen at thirty north and ninety east. From her pen, she wrote her heart. With light, unlock her love's release. I wrote this puzzle, didn't I? It, oh my God! Harry Potter wizard chess. Fuck off. Look 
coordinates might have something to do with the glow. The king and the white queen. There's something in the shields. Ugh. The coordinates might have something to do with the glow. I don't know, push the shield here. The coordinates might have something to do with the glow. This is an old game. Two shields and a white crown. Could that be the white queen? Where are the white pieces? Two shields, so get the shields over here. Ugh. Fucking wizard chess, in it. Fucking Bertie bought every flavored fucking bean, in it. Ugh. Fucking chocolate frogs, in it. You got the fucking Dumbledore card. You got one of them Dumbledore cards. You got one of them series black cards. Honestly, the only the only good thing that could ever come out of the Harry Potter world being real is Yu-Gi-Oh! real life. I thought that was it. Is that not it? I fuck up the puzzle. Might have something to do with the glow. Oh god, what was I supposed to 30 north, 90 east. Got it. Why are we playing as a child? Because Laura's having children moments. 30 North. Ninety East. Keep on moving, Laura. Keep on moving. Keep on moving, Laura. Keep on moving. Whoa! Light. Unlock her love's release. Her dad set this all up to leave him alone. Like, Laura, here's a broom puzzle. Leave me the fuck alone. Alright, I gotta go up uh, higher. How do we go up higher? This is from Columbia. I haven't seen some of these artifacts before. Need to find the White Queen. Gotta find a white queen. Gotta find a white queen. The great bat swamp is on far. All right, and then I gotta put the two shields there. Oh, okay. Well, I already kind of moved him in a prime position for that, so... Should be able to do that easily enough. Just gotta move these guys. Listen, this isn't- this isn't true at all, because if Laura was a real rich child, uh, her dad would send her off to preparatory school or whatever. Like, private school. And she'd live there all year round. Her dad would be like, I don't want to deal with you. You are too much for me. You're going to private school. And that's where you'll live until you're 18. And then here's a hundred thousand pounds. Don't talk to me again. There she is. The White Queen. Trapped. I have to help her. Now I can free her. White Queen! With light, unlock her love's release. Amazing. Nice. 
nice. Secret hole. Why don't I just have a door with a lock on it? Her heart pounding, our hero crosses the threshold into the unknown. These are mum's things. The path was dark and is guarded by bats, said the Red Knight. Did her dad set this up just for her to find it? Like, if, if her dad, like, set, her, set this up just for her to find it, what a nice dad. To challenge your kid and use your wealth for like a giant silly puzzle room. In which case, I mean, that's kind of cute. Still rich bullshit, but still kind of cute. Um, if, if his dad was using it to lock away secret treasures he wasn't supposed to have. Mario! Damn, that puzzle activated that gun in his hand. Shit. That's crazy. You did that, Laura. You did that. You killed your dad, Laura. That puzzle, that puzzle was a, was a Rube Goldberg machine. Your dad was saving that. For like a really awful moment so that he had to do the intricate puzzle. So he could be like, oh, you know what? Actually... Nice vest. Nice vest, Laura. Oh, she got armor. Yeah, the armor is cool and all, but like, what about this? What about this? Yeah, like, armor is cool and all, but like, why would I care about that when I can go back to low poly Laura? Insufficient skill points, insufficient skill points, insufficient skill points, insufficient skill points, insufficient skill points. I don't think I have anything that can only take one skill point now. I think everything is two skill points now. Well, that is whatever. Sure. 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 Fine. Fair. Valid. Sure. Fine. Fair. Valid. Do I have a gun yet? Nope. Ain't allowed. Oh, I have other gear, don't I? Uh, equipment. Oh, I can't, like, upgrade those, though. Eh. Capybara! I don't want gameplay benefits. I don't give a shit. Roleplay the game, Brendan. Oh, I love these trees! And these other trees. Oh, look at these rocks! These rocks have been here for thousands of years. 
archaeologist be like, yeah, I'm an archaeologist. I just go and dig rocks. Doesn't that make you a geologist? No, 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 no. I lick the rock and it tells me how old it is. Oh, okay. Geologists use, a, use an intricate machine to tell them how old it is. I just lick the rock. Bird. No, 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 no. I don't, I don't, I don't care about all that, like, all, the, all that equipment stuff. I'm an archaeologist. I, I use my heart to figure out how old something is. I just run around and lick rocks all day. I want to die in a pose that confuses future archaeologists. When I'm like 80 years old, I'm going to go to like a gold factory. I'm just going to be like, can I get a tour of this factory? I want a tour of this gold factory. Can you show me the giant vats of molten gold? I'm like, yeah, sure. Absolutely. They're right over here. Uh, yeah, watch out for the railing there. It's a little slippery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, sure. And then I'm going to jump into the vat of molten gold. And I'm going to yell Game of Thrones reference as I fall and die into it. They're, it's going to fuck up so much of their business. They're going to get so fucking owned. They're going to be so fucking mad. How is this game so far? It really is a Crystal Dynamics Lara Croft game. It really is a, a Tomb Raider game. This camera belongs to the X700 line. Sam had one of those. I was so jealous. It's just the thing you'd want for an expedition to find a lost monument or civilization. This is proof that there were people coming here as recently as the 1980s. Even when modernity scoffs at them, some legends still manage to inspire people. The lens is cracked. Almost looks as though it was hit by a... Somebody shot that lens. Oh my gosh, Laura. L Laura, oh my, oh my gosh. Why are those birds attached? What? Oh, this is where, oh, there's a, there's a tomb over here. There's the camp. Okay, there's a tomb I couldn't get over here. Capybara! Fucking capybara. Yeah, run. You better fucking run. If Laura wasn't rich, she would she would definitely be a Best Buy employee in a different life. If Laura didn't end up being hyper super stupid rich, she would definitely have been a Best Buy employee talking about cameras in a different life. Well, this is a DSLR. This one works more gooder because of the aperture on it. This, uh, this is a uh, mirrorless camera, and it works more gooder because it ain't got mirrors inside. This is a capybara, and it works more gooder because it's a capybara, not an actual camera. Oh, whoa. can't believe I've fallen and I can't get up. Laura's going to buy every Radio Shack that ever existed. You're like, Radio Shack's the future. This might represent one of the lords of Shababa. Shababa. This might represent one of the lords of Shababa. Shababa. How do I lift that statue somehow? It do be by climbing. Laura definitely owns a billion penny stocks in Radio Shack. Oh, that's fucked. No, Laura is definitely wicked stinky. Absolutely. Like, fucking no deodorant, no showers, wicked stinky. No shower, no toilet, no bong, wicked stinky. Ain't no Old Spice out in the jungle. Ain't no CVS out here. This is the real shit. Really in the stank. This is the real sh Laura really out here in the pits, in the stank. Laura really discovering what it's, what it's gonna be like out here in the pits, in the stank. No bong, no deodorant, no nothing. And she's gonna find a lot of stanky weed, but she won't be able to smell it because she oh, smells so bad. It obscures the stanky weed. She's not gonna find any of it. She's not gonna be able to smoke any of that crazy jungle weed. It's kind of fucked up. Not gonna lie. I feel bad for her. Is this a pop-a-top court? What? A pop-a-pop court? Like, a baseball but silly? All right, just like most Tomb Raider puzzles, I'm confused right now, but I'll figure it out, maybe? 
assuming I gotta raise the bridge here. Let me just put this back then. Laura, not even wearing any perfume. Jeesh. Don't even have any deodorant. Jeesh. No antiperspirant. Jeesh. Come on, Laura. You can do better than this. Come on, Laura. All right, let's jump on this. No, it didn't. No, it fucking didn't. Rope didn't even fucking snap. No, it did not. Oh, shit. The rope snapped. No, it... I mean, the other one did. Okay. The other rope snapped. But not the main one, Laura. There's something wrong with the cots. Not the one that matters, Laura. Laura, you go to rope school? Laura, you tie... You tie... You know all the sailor's knots, Laura? Laura, do you know the name of every sailor's knot, Laura? Huh? Huh? Do you? I don't even know the names of knots. I know like, uh, no, I don't know a single knot. Dang it, it fall. Something's wrong. How can I lock the other counterweight? Oh, it doesn't matter. I don't need to lock it. Why would I need to lock it? Or it didn't fall. There's something wrong with the carts. Why would I need to lock the counterweight, Laura? Didn't I need that to like climb or something? Can I just climb on that? Can I grab those, Laura? There's something wrong with the carts. There's not anything wrong with the carts, Laura. It worked! Oh, the two grabbing baskets. Oh, okay. They need to grab the... I need them to grab the... the thingies. I got it. I figured it out. I'm the puzzle master. I'm a puzzle psycho. I'm the crazy, wacky puzzler. I know about puzzles. I do know about fisherman's knot. I use that a lot in crochet. I don't know any knots. I know garlic knots. I know. I, I know. You know what? Actually, I know about garlic knots, though. You know I what you know what I do know. Fucking garlic knots. Hell yeah. I know about getting a, pu a bunch of gar garlic fucking pretzels. Garlic garlic knots. Yeah. I'll, I'll eat those. What, what Laura? What? Can't use those on a boat though. You can eat them on a boat. ladder isn't as rotten as it looks it literally was already in place laura is the funny thing laura it was it was already in place but you you couldn't use it because the game said no see stuff like this challenges like this i know it's hard but a lot of the time you should give players you should reward players for coming with up with their own way to do things 
right? Not, not punish them and not be like, you didn't do the sequence right. You didn't do the sequence right, you die. Should reward players, not punish them for being silly. You shouldn't be angry at them for being silly little fellas. You should reward them for being silly little fellas. That's why I like Breath of the Wild so much is because Breath of the Wild uh, rewards creativity. Like people bash on that game all the time, but it's a game that is literally about rewarding creativity. Right? The way that you solve puzzles and challenges in Breath of the Wild are so fantastic, even if the puzzles are simple, because yeah, you could do the literal way that they want you to do, or you can make it way harder on yourself and figure out how to fucking do something in, in the dumbest fucking way. Who bash a lot there are a lot of people who bash on Breath of the Wild. Um I understand if you don't like it. I just there are a lot of reasons I love that game. Uh because it was popular and it's it's easy to bash on it. It popular game. It it bad. Popular game mean it bad. I'd say the only problem that I think I, I maybe even have is maybe the degradable weapons, but there are so many ways to get weapons, and it's it's like core to the gameplay. There might be an accident in the courtroom. But I fucking love that game. So I'm excited about doing like a replay through of it. There's a lot of ways you can do things that other games just wouldn't let you because they want you to do it their way. Other games say no. Breath of the Wild says sure, why not? Play it on stream. Yeah, I will at some point. Oh, am I not able to leave this way? What way do I leave then? You know what? I know what way to leave. Uh, fast traveling through the camp. My game crashed when I fast traveled. Well, my wife's going to be home soon. So that's the end of the stream. Thanks, Laura. Uh, I'll be on later tonight, though. Uh, at around 11 p.m. CST. Uh, I'm going to play Pokemon when it releases. So that'll be that'll be a big that'll be a bigger stream. I'll have more energy then, too. I got to go and do the fucking air. I got to run errands when Shelby gets home in a little bit. So. I will see y'all later if you decide to stop by later for the Pokemon Legends Arceus stream. Bye.